G'day ladies and gentlemen, the Butts Barn here. I hope you're doing well. I have this. Holy shit. And these are hard to get your hands on right now. They are expensive, evolving skies. The prices are going through the roof. But here's something even more interesting. This is the final video on this channel to do with Pokemon. The last one. There will be no more. And you might be thinking to yourself, hang on, why? That's because there's a brand new channel, ladies and gentlemen. It's called Buttsman Pokemon. It will be the top link down below in the comment section. And I want you to go and follow it. And here's why. It's where I'm going to be posting all of my Pokemon content. And also, if you do it right now, I'm going to give something away. I'm going to give one of these babies away right here. The Buttsman figurines. Look at these. They're absolutely beautiful. Favorite Pokemon Charmander. Hates vegans. Hobby not being a cyclist. Six foot eight. Dick. Stinks. It also says somewhere along here, uh, do not put this figurine in your ass. All right, ladies and gentlemen, this baby, all you have to do to win it is head to my Instagram and send me a screenshot of you being subscribed to Buttsman Pokemon. But, ladies and gentlemen, let's get into this opening. I'm absolutely pumped. We have a huge range, and I've got to give a big shout out to an absolute legend, Zach from EB Games here in... Well, I don't know if I should say where he works, so I don't want him to get in trouble. But Zachy boy, Zachy French, fucking legend. Got a mad beard, a beautiful, beautiful man. And that is who we owe today's opening to. I went there and grabbed some quality stuff today. What we're chasing is the alt arts. That's what we are chasing today. Uh, cut, well, that is what we're chasing. If we can pull that, that's $700 plus. Um, Rayquaza, that's probably the second. We've got a lot of we've got a lot of great cards, a lot of evolutions. There's a little uh, Leafy on. What else we got? The Sylveon Alt Art, uh, the Leafy on uh, V. Uh, we got a lot of great cards to chase in this set. Of course, this set came out uh, around this time last year. So, what do we get in here? We get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight packs, and we get. Some sleeves, some dividers, some sleeves. Uh, I don't think there is a... Jesus Christ, shit's going everywhere. There is a code card. I don't believe there is anything else of note. This is box number one. I'm going to open up the rest of these and then we're going to get into the opening. There we have it, ladies and gentlemen. 40 beautiful cards. And I tell you what, at the end of this video, we're going to open up a mystery box as well, sent to us by the great people whose hat I'm wearing right now, TCG Grading. Let's hoe into this right now. I'm excited. I'm nervous. A lot of feels. So, as I said, this set is just booming in prices. It is absolutely mad how far this set has grown over the last year. And we have a Militook, Militook, Militook. Um, so yeah, very, very interesting, but uh, it just keeps going up in price. Like if you want a booster box, you know, you're talking four or five hundred dollars, uh, which, you know, this time last year, you can get them for 160 bucks. There's the Pikachu. Elemental badge and a Thievel. Two shit packs to start us off, that's all right. We'll get there, ladies and gents. We will get there. Pikachu to start us here. Pumpkaboo, we have that thing, Latoad, Emily Load, Forges. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, straight away. <laughs> Holy! That is big. That is very big. Okay, okay. Sleeve that baby up. Look at that leafy on. Alt art. Holy! That is a secret rare, maybe? Secret rare. Alternate fucking something or other. I don't know, but that is beautiful and it is safe. Oh, oh, get in there, bros. Get in there. Have a look at it. Wow. <laughs> How does it look on the back? Bit big on the top. Not, not terrible, terrible, but wow, look at that. That is the pull of the pack. We're going to put uh, Dana White candle right there and we're going to put the leafy on right look at that beautiful i'm gonna have some protein because i'm fucking excited all right let's keep going lullitoad 
That was crazy. Teddy Ursa, Mareep, Zorora, and a Sharpedo. Okay. 40 packs. Now, this is the great thing. Because this isn't from one booster box, well, it could be great. It could be terrible. Feebas, Hippopotas, Lillipup, this thing. Zena's Resolve. Ooh, and an Umbreon V. Because it is from several different um, booster, well, not booster, e ETBs, you just don't know what you're going to be able to pull. You don't know what you, you may pull absolutely nothing. You may, as we saw before, pull greatness. I, I mean, I don't know. So that's, uh, that's what's exciting about this opening right here. And with Stout Land, I'm going to close this knife because it's dangerous. But yeah, so on the new Pokemon channel, I'm always open to uh, ideas for, for videos to film there. Let me know. Uh, let me know what you want to see on there as well. Slack off, Cosifer, Love Dick, uh, Flacket Fleur, and a Vitini, 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 Vitini. Yeah, I'm always up, uh, open for different ideas as to what we should be opening on that channel. Uh, Rufflet, Lullitoad, and Belolog, Wombat, Wombat, Glossifleurfleur, Bargon, and an Apple Ton. Always open to ideas. So if you want to see vintage, if you want to see new stuff, if you want to see something in the middle, uh, let me know. Um, all right, time plow, and I'll, I'll be also doing giveaways every week as well. So if you don't win the, uh, the, the little uh, figurine this week, make sure you stick around because there'll be plenty, plenty of stuff to win as well. So all you have to do, as I said, is subscribe and make sure that you let me know that you're subscribed on Instagram. My Instagram is at the buttsman, M-A-R-N, but man. Little Plunt and a Lekalito. Nice, very nice. Evolving Skies. It just sort of was made and then it was gone and then there was a new set. It just goes so quick. Just, Pokemon just makes absolute bank. Absolute bank, because it is gambling at the end of the day. I know a lot of people like to pretend it's a fun little toy, toy game for kids. It's gambling, all right? We want that. Um, Umbreon alternate art because it's worth a thousand fucking dollars. That's what we want. Ooh, Rayquaza V. And if we can pull that, then we can pay the bloody mortgage uh, and you're not 300 bucks or 400, 500 dollars in the hole from opening up all these packs. Feebas, Hitmonchan, Slackoff, Pelipilet, Pikachu, Cutie Fly, and a Drumpa. Very nice. Okay. These open so nice. Let's go straight to the rare. Zorak. These guys open so very nicely. I'm interested to see what we can do with the new channel, if we can really build up a really nice little community there. I thought, why not? I know I was uploading them to this channel, but I just thought, let's, uh, let's mix it up a little bit. We may as well. Um, you know, it's, it's one of those things where you just keep opening cards and people enjoy it and that's just what you do. And I'll tell you what, the great thing is another old art, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> oh my God. Another old art. Insane. I've actually pulled this before, but uh, Medicham V. I think that's an old art. It should be, right? Maybe the Leafeon's not an old art. Maybe I'm full of shit. It does look good though. <laughs> All right, two great pulls to start us off with the opening. Let's see if we can keep going. That would be nice if we can get, well, I was happy with one. Let's be honest, but that's the thing. You always want more. Tentacool, Tentacruel, oh, Lycanroc V. I remember in Champion's Path, I, I pulled so many Lycanroc hollows, it was making me absolutely sick. Hello, Littlefoot, ladies and gentlemen. Little foot. Hello, buddy. Learn how to open up the door with his nose. Very proud. Proud dad. Proud dad moment. Time pole. Hypno. Talon flame. A great artwork down the Talon flame. Wow. <clears throat> All right, probably just over halfway. Just over. Drowsy. Scraggy. Feebas. Ooh, Entai reverse. And a feeble non hollow. Mm, very interesting. All right. I also got some of these uh, recently. There's a black code card. That means we get a Sylveon VMAX. I uh, got an art set of these recently. And the art set for four, card, uh, four packs, rather, 
uh, retails on eBay for about $40. So, I mean, I'd go off and say, we had around $400 worth of cards. I think that's pretty, that's, that's pretty good. And that's the type of stuff we'll see on the new page. Scraggy, and there's something in here too. Hitmonchan, Slack Off, Petatil, Lombre, hey, a right hand, full art trainer. Yeah, who gives a shit? Don't even know who you are, big dick. Don't know. Don't know who you are, big fella. Don't care. Do not give a flying fuck, young man. Okay. Put that dog in there. Let's grab this fucking fella. I've also given up trying to get binders worth of, of sets because there's just too many cards. Like, how many is in here? 203 plus all the secret, like, it's just too many. Maroop, Zoyarak, Appleton, Energy, Flathu, Fire Raw, Yusa Ring, and that thing. Um, yeah, there's just too many. And I don't understand how anyone can actually do it if they're, you know, at least for this, I'm making content out of it. Like, how can you afford to do it if you're not I don't know, if you don't have Dosh or making content out of it or, or whatever, like it's just, seems to be a bit Duralodon, 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 do. All right. Well, ladies and gentlemen, TCG Grading has also sent me a mystery box, as I said earlier. That would be very interesting to open up at the end of this video. Uh, they have just literally sent me a thing that's got question marks on the box. So, fucked if I know what's in there. It should be very, very interesting. We have a black code card, Fletchling, Scraggy, Hippopotas, Time Pole, Lilito, Amarillo, Jumple Puff. A little Jumple Puff. Don't you hate it? Don't you hate it when you get a bit of a Jumple Puff going? So, five ETBs. Vatini. Not bad, but it's not bad. God, I've done good. I spoil you. White code card, which means we have nothing. That's what's, I hate the white code cards. I hate them. I can't remember who I was watching the other day, but they were mentioning, wouldn't it be great if there were God boxes? Not with every pack was a, uh, a rare. Ooh, Drampa, suck us off. Um, not where every pack like has a, every every card and every pack is a rare, but a box full of the black code cards where you you know you're gonna get um, something flash in every single pack, at least a hollow. Uh, that would be nice. That would be very very nice. We have a Flogus and a Bergmite. But yeah, one of the one of the better sets, I think, Evolving Skies, you know, there's a Rayquaza, and then there's all the evolutions, and that's what made it for everyone. Glaceon V, very nice. That's what made it for everyone. Um, you know, I just think that's such a, they're just such a great uh, part of the Pokemon world, uh, the old little evolutions, evolutions, evolution, evolution. But yeah, no, very, very interested to see if we can get something out of these last few packs. We shall see Talonflame there. So that's a white code card, as you can see. We've got a big stack of cards here. Um, yeah, so make sure you, oh, black code card, what do we got? Make sure you head over to Buttsman Pokemon. C dot slacking. Ooh, a Vatin, we've pulled like four of those. It's disgraceful. The pull rates on this, like all of the modern sets, the alt arts are just impossible to pull. Just impossible. Like that $700 card that we were talking about, it just, it doesn't exist. Like, it's so hard to get, it just doesn't get pulled. So, white code card, poo. All right, three to go. Come on, ladies and gentlemen. And then we're gonna jump straight in to the very, very exciting mystery box. We have a Ampharos. I tell you what, I think we've done well. I think we did well. From, you know, to pull a couple of alt arts, what I believe are alt arts, Umbreon V, not the Umbreon we want, what I believe to be um, uh, alt arts, I think that's pretty good. All right, let's slow roll this baby. Last pack, let's get some magic. What can we do? We have the code card. All right, we go four from the back. When in doubt, four from the back. Fire energy, can we pull it? A love lug, switching cups, Zurora, Psyduck, Rufflet, Drowsy, Flubbly! Nothing. Ladies and gentlemen, go and check out. Well, not go and check out. Let's open up the mystery box right now.
Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. What have we got in here? Do, 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 do. Ooh. Okay. We have a TCG hat. Oh my God. We have some easy pull, easy tab pull sleeves. What are these? Card essentials, very online of collective protective uh, accessories. We have, ooh, chilling rain. Okay. We have Metazoo with a Cumberland Dragon. We have some of these babies. Now, these are for your graded cards. We have the great man, TCG Grading. Go and check him out. Hey, little foot, what's happening, mate? We have, thank you for your order. Discount, there's a discount for you. Right there. Go and check him out right now. We've got some pop models. What do we have? We have a limited edition Stanley Hudson figure from The Office. Okay. Far out. That's awesome. Thank you. You get Michael Scott, Dites, right, Jim Halpert, and Jan Levinson. What else do we have? We have another one in here. Okay. Ooh, from Squid Games. Special edition. Funko Pops. That's cool. This is the mask worker. That's probably one of the most... Um, that's the one you want, really. We have two more packages in here. Ooh! Game of Thrones, the card game. King's Car Kingsguard chapter pack. Okay. Uh, so it's all based on Game of Thrones. Um, core set is required to play. Contains cards. Uh, this is from 2003. Uh, I don't know if this is worth opening or not. I'm, I'm really not sure. Uh, it's cool, though. I like it. I'll set that there. I think I'd like to keep this one sealed, too. This is a first edition MetaZoo pack. I feel like, you know, MetaZoo, um, it's it's a good, it's fun. It's good fun. Chilly Rain, we can open that. Let's open up Chilly Rain right now before we get into anything else. Um, yeah, MetaZoo's a funny one because I know some guys came together who really love Pokemon uh, and the big guys in the Pokemon sphere and they decided to make MetaZoo. I don't, know, I don't know much about it, but it's certainly interesting. There's your code card. Uh, what do you reckon? It's four from the back. Hopefully this isn't the hollow. It's not. What have we got? We have a Melanie, a Cybold, a Drizzle, a Galarian Farfetch'd, a Weedle, an Aaron, a Blitzel, a Lapras, a Brawly, and a Galarian Weezing. And therein lies the problem with that particular pack. What do we have in here? This is terrifying. I don't know what we have. Oh, we've got a graded card. It's a Japanese graded card. <sighs> Ooh, a Pokemon Go Venusaur. So we have a Venusaur from Pokemon Go, and it's a uh, Mint 9. Nice. Very nice indeed. And what do we have here? Another seal pack. Let's open this baby up. We have another graded card. There's the back of it. It is Pokemon. It's got a little bit of whitening up in there. Ooh, we got an Ivasaur base set too. What can we get here? Can we get an eight? Nice. Awesome. I feel like, I feel like I should open that. What is this? Wilderness first edition. Hmm. All right, well, let us know, ladies and gents. We might even open it up in a different video. But these are pretty cool. Thank you very much to TCG Grading. How good's that? I do love a little surprise. That came out of nowhere. Absolute legends. All right, see you later. Bye. I'm kidding. Of course I'm going to open this. This is exciting. And this is, this is the great thing about these. These were actually made to sort of resemble, I assume anyway, to resemble what Pokemon cards used to come in back in the day. So let's open her up. I have no idea what the chase cards are in here. I know we want a hollow, that's for sure. Uh, let's get this out. We'll get the little dragon out. Um, it's still sealed, I'm pretty sure. A little coin in there too. That's a bit Pokemon-y. Hey, there you go. Cumberland Dragon, first edition, still sealed. Not bad. And there we have uh, a little Bigfoot do, a little mini Bigfoot. All right. Let's see what we can get out of here. Uh, I'm not sure what the card trick is. We have a camouflage 
fo- a flare shot, a gasser, a unicorn, an EMP, a stone eating, phantom car. Oh, there you go. There's a rocky hollow and a golden bear. There are the two rares. Um, very, very nice. I feel like we should have a look in here. Um, I don't open it. Okay, cool. I will open it. Let's see what we've got in here. Uh, big Game of Thrones fan myself, but what do we got? We have Eastwatch Envoy. That is a... Oh, okay, it basically just explains the whole thing, uh, how to play the game. What do we have? We have Shadow Killer. Let's open it up. I, I've never heard of this game um, for obvious reasons, but thank you very much to CCG Grading. This is very interesting. I do like opening new and weird and strange things. It is exciting. I mean, if I can get the fucking thing open, that is. Well, this video is open. I can't get it open. Hang on, where's me knife? Where's me knife, everybody? There it is. Shadow killer. Got a big scratch on it now. Hope you're all happy. Okay. We've got a shadow killer, a shadow killer, a misandry, a melisandry, Gragon good brother, longship grey ghost, Tywin Lannister. Look better in the show. The Hound looked heaps better in the show. Martells saw, I guess, Mount Sanjora Mormont. I think in the show he was a lot more, a lot older, wasn't he? Happy, although they may, they maybe have they have done quite well. So Jamie Lannister, nah, he's better in the show. I'll make the play some scrape. Uh, Marin, so Marin, uh, Mandor Moore. I don't know if I've heard of him. Uh, Greenfield, Oakheart, don't know him. Boris Bont, right, ladies and gentlemen, this is weird. <laughs> Be a good motherfucker. Peace in the Middle East. Dick stinks. Thank you very much, TCG. Toodle well, bye bye.